A colossal new machine has arrived in Florida, marking a major leap for space exploration. SpaceX's Starship Transporter is no ordinary truck, it's a custom-built giant, engineered to move the world's most powerful rocket. Its debut at Kennedy Space Center signals SpaceX's Mars ambitions are taking shape on the Space Coast. The transporter is essential for moving Starship components, enabling rapid reusable launches. It's the backbone of ground operations, ensuring smooth assembly and preparation before each mission. More than just hardware, it's a symbol of SpaceX's commitment to making Florida a hub for interplanetary travel. The transporter's massive scale is a visual reminder of the Starship program's audacity. Every move, even across a few miles, requires bespoke engineering. Standard trucks just won't do. Its successful deployment is a win for the engineers making deep space travel possible. With this transporter, the Space Coast is one step closer to becoming the gateway to the solar system. Moving massive rocket parts is a hidden challenge of the space industry. Rockets are built far from launch pads making transport a logistical puzzle. On land, special permits and escorts are needed to navigate roads and avoid obstacles. The sheer size of boosters often makes land transport impractical, pushing companies to use the sea. Maritime transport offers open routes but brings risks, saltwater corrosion, rough seas and unpredictable weather. Rockets travel on specialized ships, protected from the elements, but every voyage is a calculated risk. SpaceX and others are investing in custom ships with advanced stabilization and protective enclosures. These vessels will not only deliver new rockets but also recover reusable boosters, streamlining the launch process. Reusability means the return journey is as important as delivery. Building a robust sea transport network is now essential for affordable, sustainable spaceflight. Though less glamorous, these evolving systems are vital to the future of space access. Even veteran space companies face setbacks. Northrop Grumman's Cygnus XL is a recent example. During a key test, the upgraded Cygnus XL's main engine failed to ignite, leaving it stranded in orbit. The mission was meant to prove the spacecraft's readiness for heavier cargo runs to the ISS. Instead, the failure triggered a thorough investigation into the engine, fuel system, and software. This incident is a stark reminder. New systems always carry risk, no matter the experience behind them. Demonstration flights are crucial for uncovering issues before real missions. The ongoing investigation will shape the future of Cygnus XL. In spaceflight, failures are data points. Each one makes future missions safer and more reliable. Amid the challenges of spaceflight, SpaceX's Dragon stands out for its reliability. Over a decade, Dragon has become the backbone of ISS logistics, both for cargo and crew. Its success is built on iterative design, extensive testing, and a relentless focus on safety. While others face setbacks, Dragon's steady cadence provides NASA with a dependable lifeline. Reusability is key. SpaceX recovers, refurbishes, and reflies Dragon capsules, cutting costs and building experience. Each mission yields data, allowing continuous improvements and greater durability. Dragon's track record sets the benchmark for commercial spaceflight. It proves that with the right approach, private companies can deliver safe, reliable systems for human space exploration. Firefly Aerospace's journey shows that failure is part of reaching orbit. After a dramatic 2021 launch failure, Firefly investigated, fixed issues, and earned a return to flight. The root cause, a premature engine shutdown, led to reinforced systems and improved software. Regulatory approval for a second launch marked a critical milestone. Firefly's resilience highlights the grit needed to survive in the launch market. Recovering from failure tests a company's resolve and engineering skill. Firefly's Alpha rocket targets the booming small satellite market. By overcoming setbacks, Firefly strengthens the commercial space ecosystem. Their perseverance is helping build a more competitive, innovative launch industry. As rockets evolve, so does the training for those who operate them. The new era demands highly skilled controllers, engineers, and technicians. Training now blends traditional expertise with advanced simulations for unprecedented scenarios. For Starship, teams rehearse orbital refueling and simultaneous booster and upper stage landings. Recovery crews develop new methods for handling massive reusable rockets at sea. The success of spaceflight depends on this investment in human capital. Behind every mission are thousands of experts whose skills make it possible. As missions grow more complex, developing these professionals is as vital as building the rockets themselves. Today's commercial spaceflight is a mix of bold progress and tough challenges. The Starship Transporter's arrival in Florida is a symbol of the industry's momentum. Yet setbacks like the Cygnus XL anomaly remind us space is unforgiving. 
What sets this era apart is resilience. Failures are now seen as opportunities to learn and improve. Firefly's comeback and Dragon's steady success show the value of iteration and persistence. The industry is diversifying with new rockets, spacecraft and support systems emerging. Innovations in logistics like specialized ships are as crucial as the rockets themselves. The journey ahead will be long and complex with more challenges to come. But the industry's rapid growth and hard-won wisdom are paving the way to the stars. Progress is built not on perfection but on relentless ingenuity and the refusal to give up.